So red cabbage next. And this one was a little bit drier. And obviously as I go through this, they will be drying out. So I'll be keeping an eye on that. So again, just a sprinkling of water. Like that. Then I'll use a spoon just so if it's easier, because sometimes they can be a little bit fiddly as well. So that's not a massive amount on there. Can you see from there? It's like half. And again, just roughly. Some of the seeds look really, really similar as well. Um, particularly broccoli, red cabbage and kale. So there we go. And then again, a sprinkling of water. Make sure they're fully covered. And again, if it looks a bit like you've overdone it and you think that they might drown a bit, you can use a tissue just to absorb that extra water. But generally, it's not going to cause any problems, especially if they're in a warm area. And again, you can mark it and lid. We've also included a little mini growing calendar. Um, just because it's helpful for you to gauge when you're planting, say if it was on a Monday, which one you planted, um, you could give it a code, but also P for planted, L for light, um, H for harvest. So then you'll get start getting an idea of how long how long they tend to grow. Obviously the kits, our main microphone kits are designed that they grow at a very similar rate. Um, so you can harvest them, you plant them, and then you bring them to light, harvest them, and you know it could continue us. But some of them, especially in our uh, greens for a year and our different new products, um, they're not always. They don't always grow exactly the same. Uh, red cabbage actually is one of the ones that takes a little bit longer, whereas rocket is one of the speedy ones, along with radish. But again, I've created some download sort of cheat sheets for each of the seed types, which you will have access to, and you'll be able to see what rate we, we generally say they grow at um, so you can base your planting on that or just give it a go and just try different things because it's sort of meant to be a consistent healthy habit we're creating and it's all good trial and error so that's red cabbage